let's say you are editing a sequence in a timeline and suddenly you realize that in the middle of this timeline you want to insert a piece of text or some fusion motion graphic and you need to move all the clips to the right hand side of the playhead over to the right a little bit to make room for it so in this kind of scenario what you can do is to hit the y key what this will do is very quickly select all the clips to the right hand side of the playhead including the clip that the playhead is currently hovering over and when this is when all these clips are selected then you can make changes move them over all at the same time and the opposite works similarly what you need to do is to hit the command y key this will select all the clips to the left hand side of the playhead including the clip that the playhead is currently hovering over which you will also notice is the clip that we just selected so if you don't want this clip what you could do is to hit the hold down the command key click this clip to deselect it from the selection or what you could do is simply um, make sure that you move the playhead a little bit over to the left and then um, hit the command Y key. Uh, this will uh, select all the clips on the other side of the timeline. And when you have multiple tracks like this and you want to select all the clips on all the tracks, what you could do is to hit the option Y key. This will select all the clips, uh, all the tracks to the right hand side of the playhead. And if you hit command option Y key, this will select all the clips on all the tracks to the left hand side of the playhead. And basically all these keyboard shortcuts we just discussed are the same commands as if you were to go to timeline and to select uh, under uh, select clips back backward or select clips forward, they perform exactly the same operation. Lastly, I just want to mention that on the cut page, you have very similar command as well. So once you're on the cut page, what you can do is to right click the playhead. Then you have two logos on each side of the playhead that allows you to select either all the clips to the right hand side of the playhead or all the clips to the left hand side of the playhead. OK, guys, so that's basically it. Um, this is something that I personally find very, very useful. I use it quite a lot, and I think it's something that can definitely help you speed up your editing process. So I hope you uh, enjoy this uh, quick little tutorial and I will see you next time.